Aveniba Shay. Good morning, Democrats. It's an absolute pleasure to be standing here in front of you today at this beautiful Congress. Across South Africa, DA governments are bringing about change and making history. And like many municipalities, our municipality, Umgeni, was limping along with broken systems, plagued by corruption, mismanagement, and maladministration. Our municipality was on the brink of corrupt, collapse, with corruption, unaccounted for money, and service delivery at an all-time low. The ANC had failed the people of Umgeni. But people were looking for hope. The journey to win Umgeni started 18 years ago under the leadership of Greg Crumbrock. And in 2021, we made history in KwaZulu-Natal when we won the first municipality by just 42 votes. 42 votes. We created history, driven by our motto that we are doing this for sacrifice and not status. We took the reins of power and immediately got to work. We started by conducting a thorough audit of the finances, assets, skills, and capacity of the municipality to deliver. We found millions of rands misspent, severe pass gouging, non-existent human resources, policies that didn't exist, and no leadership and direction. It was up to us, the 13-man DA caucus, my team, who I'm very proud of, and the broader DA family in KwaZulu-Natal and leadership to bring our municipality out of darkness. From day one, we set the marching orders for our institution. We sent a clear message of zero corruption. We put in place stringent measures to ensure value for money spending and that that becomes institutionalized by establishing the Municipal Public Accounts Committee, by recapacitating our audit committee, and ensuring that this became a thing that people knew that we were serious about. Based on DA best practice and drawing from municipalities like Stellenbosch and Drakenstein, Midval and many more, we adopted policies to support our activities. We've been creating a culture of transparency and accountability by doing practical things, such as opening up the tender process to the public and randomizing the temporary selection of employees. South Africans are hungry for a government that can get the basics right. And in the last 15 months, we've achieved some of the following amongst others. We've spent 24 million rand on specialized equipment like TLBs and tipper trucks, rollers and excavators. We've increased the number of people who have access to free basic services from 133 to over 3,000. We've doubled our roads budget from 11 million to 24 million. We've established a municipal traffic department for the very first time. We've completed 6 million rands worth of projects that were left unfunded and decaying by the ANC. We've installed 400 LED street lights, installed solar lighting in informal settlements, increased waste collection to rural areas, have load shedding proof traffic lights, and many, many more. But importantly, the Auditor General gave us a vote of confidence and we improved our municipal audit outcome from qualified to unqualified. <laughs> Through hard work and dedication, we are turning the Umgeni local municipality around. 27 years of destruction, policies and cater deployment are being painstakingly undone. We are rebuilding our communities. We are determined to show that the DA difference is something real and that the DA keeps to its promises and that we get things done. There is hope for our cities, towns, villages, across the whole of South Africa. And in each and every corner of our country, we must continue to build a strong DA that can deliver a better future. Lena le South Africa fanes kubeg saka it DA ezo waka igu sasa elingo engon. We are building and we are going to deliver a better future for all. Thank you so much.